All right, guys, so welcome back to Invest with Prince, and today I'm back at you with five catalysts that can take Sundial Growers to symbol SNDL to $2 plus. But before I get into this video, if you could please smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, that subscribe button should not be red, it should be grey, and also hit that notification bell for the latest band opportunities. So last week, I told you guys about Orbital Energy Group and my five best clean energy stocks to buy now and it was sitting at around $7 at that time, $7. And today Orbital Energy Group tested highs of $11, but I do see the stock testing $10 very, very soon. And also I do have a private Discord, the link is below in the description. And a couple of days ago, I recommended Fluent Incorporation, tick symbol FLNT at $5 flat. A fluent incorporation on that same day broke six dollars and also broke six dollars today and again it's been on the downtrend since due to all the commotion regarding gamestop and amc so let's get into this video regarding sound our growers and why sound our growers can go to two dollars and before i continue i just want to warn you guys about the stock it is very very volatile one of the most volatile stocks I own so always remember with these penny stocks you don't have to go all in it's always good to manage your risk instead of aiming for that fast money because you can lose money as fast as you make it so let's start with the first catalyst and that is Sandal Growers debt clearance so at the end of 2019 they had a hundred and seventy eight million dollars worth of debt and forty five million dollars in cash whilst they were burning this cash in its operations and they swapped stock for debt by selling the uk business which resulted in sandal growers being debt free and also having 21 million dollars in cash and the second catalyst here which i feel like is one of the most important ones is that sundial growers must have 10 consecutive days above one dollar before june otherwise they will be delisted and it seems like the ceo is making a push for this because on january the 11th he announced some new products so the ceo said sundial growers will produce premium products based on demand from a growing group of consumers for solventless flavorful pure and potent cannabis concentrates so they feel like they're making progress in that regard in terms of getting those products out and generating that revenue for the company in order for them to gain more invested attention so they can remain above one dollar for the 10 days they need so they don't get delisted and the next catalyst is the democrats being in power so the bill for cannabis decriminalization is more likely to pass a democrat-led senate rather than a republican-led senate so this is another catalyst going forward and i do feel like later on in the year we'll hear some news about whether this bill is passed or not and last but not least the fact that this has gained so much investor interest especially overnight could be a reason to send over one dollar and to two dollars very very soon and i feel like a lot of people on reddit have been looking to pump the stock overnight so it's up 26 percent right now after hours it was up seven percent today it did have a strong finish going into market close and for those who didn't know if these people on reddit want to pump a stock they will pump the stock look at gamestop stock look at amc they pump these stocks to the moon 1700 percent return on gamestop stock for anyone who was invested in it and amc entertainment was up 300 percent today alone 300 percent so they really pumped these stocks just because they wanted to they pumped it because they wanted to and they could do the same thing with sundial growers so when it comes to cannabis stocks sundial growers is the easiest to manipulate as it sees the biggest fluctuations in price and also has a high short flow so when this gets going above 0 0.80 dollars then one dollar we can see the stock fly off we could see the stock go to one dollar fifty or even two dollars so this is why i do feel like this stock can go to two dollars very soon especially with the strong investor interest and with everything going on right now i feel like people are just going to move the profits from gamestop they're going to move the profits from amc and they're going to pump the next stocks you see today naked brand tick symbol nakd was the next stock to go and also towards market close you saw genius brands go tick symbol g and us and after hours sundial growers is also moving so who's to say that sundial growers cannot run once it breaks that 80 cents resistance 
we can see the stock easily go to one dollar maybe one dollar and fifty then two dollars very very soon so we have to wait and see what happens on market opening but again for those of you who are trying to get into the stock always wait for that pullback always wait for that pullback before starting your position because you don't want to get caught bag holding you don't want to get caught at a loss stocks do fly open on market opening and then dip down before going back up so that's when ideally if i wanted to get into the stock or add to my position i would buy and also you've also got to remember that you can't be chasing the stock if it does fly up too high because if it does fly too high you could get caught holding a bag you could be in the red very very soon because if you do buy at the top the stock will just fall back down and no one knows when stocks like these will recover because it is a penny stock and it is pumped and dumped these penny stocks are not your friend you can't fall in love with the tick symbol although you might like the company you've also got to remember that this is a penny stock at a penny stage and right now the investor interest for the long-term prospects are not there people are just here to make some quick money of these penny stocks so you've always got to keep that in mind and that's where you should also remember you can't be putting your whole portfolio in these penny stocks you should only put what you could afford to lose because it may not always go your way and when it doesn't go your way you don't want to be at a great loss which you can't recover because this company won't recover anytime soon so always be smart when investing in these penny stocks and tread cautiously so that is my take on sandal growers and the five catalysts that can take it to two dollars i feel like above one dollar we should see going to two dollars very very soon so if you do have any questions or comments feel free to comment it down below i'll happily reply to everyone and also if you did enjoy this video please give it a thumbs up subscribe to the channel that subscribe button should not be red it should be gray and also hit that notification bell for the latest brand opportunities as it says in the comments 100 likes and i'll let you guys know what my next home run stock is so yeah thank you very much for all the support almost at a thousand subscribers and i'll catch you guys in the next video